Hey everybody, I'm back again. It's Kathy, and I'm here this time with Tabitha, and I just thought she could hang with me because um, I just did that box opening, and I wanted to show off her cute little leggings that she got, or um, stockings, I guess, with the little kitty cats that are in the blue, and it looks so cute with this, this outfit of hers. So, what I'm here for this time is to do a prompt for other people. So I'm hoping that what I realized or noticed the other day when I was watching videos would catch your, catch your uh, mind or catch, you know, catch your imagination and, and you'll uh, make videos to go with this one. So, um, and I have notes because, yeah, I don't want to spend my whole time saying, um, um, so I noticed the other, in the last couple of weeks, we've had a, a number of people have had uh, videos up and involving um, spouses, boyfriends, girlfriends, um, good friends, family members, um, and their support. And one of the people was Ann Picaro. And she did her, her box opening where her husband had seen the uh, animator dollies were, were going out of, um, they weren't going to be available. And so he purchased the two that she liked the best for her as a surprise. Um, and I don't know, I, um, Denali, you always, um, or often, He's typing away in the background, doing his own thing as she's making her videos. And um, uh, the Q-tips, I'm sure I'm saying that wrong. Um, she showed off her um, dolls. Her husband has dolls too. And, and he helps with um, miniatures and dioramas and recently um, purchased a doll that he knew she really wanted and, and, and said she could keep it. So that, I mean, things like that got me thinking about um, all that my husband does um, that is supportive of my hobbies, depending, you know, depending on which hobby I'm in at the time. I tend to go through phases. So, um, yeah, so the BJD prompt is um, to tell about someone in your life, an important person in your life, who supports you in your hobby and how so. And so I'll, um, my husband's been supportive of whatever I've been into and in my dolly phase, um, even though I, he collects um, miniatures and he does um, Dungeons and Dragons and paints and all that sort of thing. So we are um, alike in that we're always watching for what's new and, and possibly um, doing, um, putting in pre-orders and those sorts of things. So he understands from that perspective. Um, and he's always supportive of me with my dolls and, and doesn't, you know, he's not really interested in them. Um, I would say he's more interested in them than he was when I had a horse and he had no interest whatsoever in horses, barns, hay, anything like that. But um, one thing I can always count on, and, and I'm always very aware of the cost of the dolls, and, um, and you know, sometimes I think, well, I'd like to have something, but I need to, you know, to do that, I really need to sell a doll. And he always um, will say, why are you selling a doll? Are you sure you want to sell the doll? And you know he's he um, um, he's very supportive in that way. So if I didn't really you know think that I was done with the doll or whatever, um, then he would definitely be supporting me in keeping the doll. So um, and I know a couple of the dolls I have sold in the past I've regretted later and. Um, and he knows that too, so he's very supportive in that. And when he's out at events, he's always watching for little things that will be the right size or the right scale for my dolls, because he, the things he's into are all in-scale things. So 
Um, he does that for me too, and he supports our activities that we do with our dolls, Pet Book and I, and uh, yeah, so he's really special, he's really supportive. Um, and then my other big supporter is my um, older sister, and she's, which is good, because she's the one I travel with, and, and so all the times I've taken my dolls on my travels and been out in public and in tourist locations and posing my dolls and taking pictures, she's been there, so it's good that she's supportive, um, or she would be, you know, e even more mortified um, uh, when, when we were doing those things, but she's really supportive, and she actually keeps track of their names, and and um, what's up with the dolls and, and that. So I have two really um, super supportive people in my life in the hobby, and that's not counting Pet Took, who is my daughter, who got me into the hobby in the first place. Um, so yeah, I've been really, really lucky. But for most people, I hope you have at least one person in your life that, that provides support, positive feedback, um, or just w is willing to listen to you talk about your dolls. And um, and if you don't in your immediate circle, in, in physical presence, I hope that you, you find that uh, encouragement and support in the community. Um, anyway, so my prompt is to talk about the significant person or people in your life who support you and um, encourage you in your doll hobby. Anyway, so I hope there will be lots of responses. I, I can't wait to hear. I, I mean, as I said, I've already heard, I already hear on a regular basis from various people on their, um, on their posts um, things about the support they get. Um, and so, now I'd like to aim for videos specifically about where you're getting, where you get that support and who it is in your life that's supporting you in your hobby. So I look forward to that. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.